Hey everybody, Adam Schwartz with EXP Realty here in Reading. Uh, it's the Monday right after Easter. Just doing a quick check-in with you. Had a great Easter. Went to a, a Good Friday service Friday night. Uh, hung out with the family Saturday and Sunday. Went to church on Sunday. Uh, it was a great service and spent some time um, over at my wife's parents' house uh, eating some food and playing cornhole. Um, I did win uh, most of the games, if not all of the games. I'm not going to say anything, but I uh, had a good time and it was a beautiful day out. So uh, let's talk about the market real quick. Rates are still going up. Rates are still sitting in anywhere between the high fives to six, low sixes, and the market is still moving. You know, last week I just looked and we had 130 new listings come to the market here in Chester County, and we had 130 seven homes going to escrow so we actually had more homes going to escrow than new homes come on the market um and it's something to keep an eye on with w rates now the federal reserve is supposed to meet next month to discuss um, raising rates again to combat inflation inflation is at about eight and a half percent all-time highs um, the housing market all-time highs gas all-time highs everything's really expensive which most of us know. And one of the ways they combat inflation is by raising rates, um, which definitely makes affordability tough, especially for first time buyers or anybody really in the market. Um, we'll kind of keep an eye on, we'll report back to you once we find out more of, you know, how that's gonna directly impact interest rates. But as of right now, if you are looking or have been looking for a home, now is the time. Prices are not coming down from what we can see and rates are not coming back down. So the cost of waiting could be substantial. Same thing if you are thinking of selling. For every 1% the interest rate goes up and it affects the buyer's purchase power by 10%. So if you were approved for $400,000 last year and your rate was three and a quarter and today rates are 6%, you can imagine that's you know that's a very big swing in price difference. A three three hundred twenty five thousand dollar house is a lot different than a four hundred thousand dollar house. Prices have kind of not come down yet, and rates are continuing to go up. So the cost of waiting to either sell or buy could be thousands and thousands of dollars, or it could affect your payment. Now, if you're currently renting, you are paying a hundred percent interest. However you want to look at it, you are paying 100% interest. So even if rates do go up, is paying 100% interest better than the 6% or whatever the rates are at? In most cases, no. If you're going to be in Shasta County for more than two years, we're expected to see, you know, the on a conservative side, 5 to 6% appreciation. The last couple of years, it's been higher than that you will still in most cases benefit from owning a home and paying down your own mortgage versus renting and paying 100% interest. So if you have any questions, I'm here at the office all week. Would love to connect with you. Want to say thank you to the referrals. Got a couple great referrals last week. Looking forward to helping them um, buy and sell a few homes. And I hope you have a great day. Talk to you soon.